Hello and welcome to this week's CCA Roundup. It's been a really positive week at CCA as we head in to our half term break. It's been brilliant last night to have our year nine options and GCSE parents evening. It was fantastically attended. Um, we had over 220 parents carers at the event. Thank you so much to all those parents and carers that gave up their time to attend those sessions. It was brilliant to have the conversations around academic performance, around their option subjects, around what is it they would like to do in the future, and looking at those career potentials. It was brilliant to have conversations around their interests and aspirations to ensure that your son or daughter is on the right pathway, ready in year 10 for their GCSE. So thank you so much for everyone that turns up. On our website is our options brochures. It's got videos around different subjects, Please look on there, make your decisions, get your completed GCC options form in, and we will then build that timetable for you in year nine. So really excited and thank you so much for all attending. Yesterday, we also had our fantastic NHS VR workshop, and this was absolutely brilliant. This is for our year 10 students who are in health and social care, and they had the opportunity to put on VR headsets and then dive into the human body. Students who are interested in dentistry had the opportunity to go inside a mouth and see what's in there, how does it work, how would our teeth be uh, corrected, how can our teeth be looked after, and then they went further into the body looking at parts of the, the muscle, the bone, the blood system, our circulatory system. Absolutely fantastic. And what an amazing use of technology to have our students experience that, to find out if that's an area of education that they would like to go into. So thank you so much to the NHS for bringing that in. Further to that, on the 8th of March, because our students did so well, they have been invited to a further NHS workshop at Colchester Institute um, to develop them further as future healthcare leaders. So that's absolutely fantastic. Well done to all of those students. Okay, let's move on to our shout outs. First up, Miss Middleditch. She wants to say well done to Hope Stebbing for her part in the Children's Mental Health First Aid Week. So well done to Hope as well as Amelia Ronald for her amazing support. So well done to both of you. You launched, you ran, you led the video for uh, Mental Health Week. So well done to you. Next up, Miss Steele wants to say well done to Tia Haylett for her excellent uniform, improved attendance, 29 positives, no negatives, brilliant reading and tutor activities. Well done to you, Tia. She'd also like to say well done to Imogen Harrington for her excellent uniform, good attendance, and lots and lots of positives, so well done to you, Imogen. Mrs. Slim would also like to nominate Talia Watkinson for the highest positives in the class, the lowest negatives, and her consistent contributions to discussion for the CCA Edge and for Votes to Schools, so well done to you. She'd also like to nominate Alfie Weller for his maturity and the contribution to the masterclass on the recent drama trip, well done to you. He also has constant positives and really few negatives. Miss Parsons would like to nominate Maisie for always being so positive, organising uh, the equipment in the class and always being on time and punctual. So well done to you, Maisie. She'd like to nominate Darren for settling in so well, being extremely polite, really working well in the reading time. And to Daniel Bush for taking Darren under his wing, settling him into it as a new student into CCA. So well done to both of you. Mr. Cologne would like to send a message to the year 10 geography students to really appreciate the maturity, the commitment, and the buy-in to the lesson yesterday, and they all absolutely smashed it, so well done to you. He's really excited to see what you can achieve as a group of geographers and as brilliant individuals, so well done to you. And Miss McLaren, she wants to say she's really pleased uh, to see the following students at the BTEC Sport Intervention on Tuesday. So that was Bethany Karras, Maka, Cameron, Freddie, Tyson, Tommy, Harvey, and Talia. Well done to you, keep working. The coursework is getting better and better and you will smash this. Keep up the good work. And just before I sign off, I just want to remind our, our year 11 students, we have our February half term school. Lots of events going on there, all on the website. Please ensure you turn up. Please ensure you attend those extra events. And for year 11 and year 13, this is now a massive next half term. You've done absolutely brilliantly. You've now got 10 weeks until your final examinations and the next six weeks after half term, absolutely crucial. Please continue to work hard, continue to prepare, so you can do the very best for yourself in those summer examinations. To everyone, thank you for all your hard work this half term. It's been a long time since Christmas. We're now fully into the spring term. Have a super, super break. Please rest, stay safe, and I will see you on Monday, 26th of February at 8.40 as we return to CCA. Thank you.